Uh, it states marks its 33rd year anniversary of former Commissioner of Information in the state. And Arabic Kazim uh, Afigwa uh, said that there was nothing to celebrate about, while noting that uh, in the last seven and a half years, the governor of a led administration has been nothing but deceptive to the people. Now, Afigwa, who spoke to journalists in Benin City, the Edo State capital, claimed that the people of the state have only experienced several promise and failed antics of the current administration, which is bid to win a wind down by the 12th of November later in the year when Governor Godwin Obaske will be handing over the, to a person who will emerge winner of the next month's governorship election in the state. Before that listed several projects, the governor promised the people while campaigning for his election in 2016, a situation is said has left the people of the state more perplexed. He, however, called on the people of the state to be mindful of whom they will be choosing as the next governor of the state come September the 21st. You can't give what you don't have. If you have a genuine heart to serve a dope people, your genuine heart should reflect in the policies and programs you, you, you carry out. How do you reconcile it, my brother, that an Obaseki or a federal government sent 20 trucks of rice to Edo. The governor did not disclose to anybody. They went and hide all these rice in their PDP chieftain's home until the end bad governance protest that exposed his hypocrisy. Exposed him to the whole world. The people's rice that is meant for the people, you are hiding them. You want to rebag them into a do state uh, rice as if you are the one presenting to the people. Then you allow people to be abusing the federal government of not doing anything. Aside from that, they have given them. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.